Hello everyone, and welcome back to Dampstone. So, thinking along, been a couple days since I last recorded here. Yes, there's Dampstone everywhere. Yes, I know, Dampstone, Dampstone. I think we'd be almost done with it by now. Anyway, yes. Can't do much or nothing until this gets done. I'll just keep dragging me back over here. Technically, I could go into the init, into the options, and tell it not to zoom me to damp stone. But as I said before, I want the the better safe than sorry idea, where if I actually do end up digging into something like an aquifer, I want to make sure that I don't flood my fortress. I actually think we may be done. Once there's more to the very south. And there shouldn't be. So, good. Okay, so. They'll go ahead and do that. Once we get that cleared out, we'll pierce the water up above and get a move on there. I haven't had a whole lot of comments giving me any suggestions on what I should do. So, I welcome those at any time. Um, I did get a comment just yet today on Episode 7, I think it was. Um, it was Aper asking me what version of DF I would recommend people play. Um, I'll answer that in a second. Since Lovely. Nothing to catch in the central swamps. No fish. None at all. Uh, an ocean map with no fish. I just, I don't know what to say about that. It's just craziness. He's still fishing there. Did he catch something? Mm, I don't know. Somehow I don't think so. Still showing either six or eight on fish. No, no raw fish, so yeah. Lovely. Uh, hopefully we can trade for something with shells. But it kind of sucks that we're on an ocean map and we can't eat any fish. It's just pretty, pretty poor. Pretty, pretty poor. Anyway, the question about that I'm um, digging. Since I want to go down here, this dug out. About which DF version to play? Um, I would suggest just going for the newest one. You get the most features. I mean, there's always going to be bugs because it's still in beta. Um, some people play the lesser versions, the earlier ones. They're a little more stable. 40D was very stable. It lacked a lot for me, I'll tell you that right now. I mean, the new stuff is good, in my opinion. The new body shapes and new body combat, I don't know. The reports, you'll see later on. I like the reports quite a bit. The healing, um, it's plenty bugged still, but I think it's pretty good. I mean, Brings another aspect of something that you would expect in a Dwarven Fort. So, this is probably going to be my barracks right here, in case anybody's wondering. Nice and centered. I guess that works. Okay. So get back to work. What's everybody else doing? Uh, the woodcutter and our farmers still don't have anything to do. Dang. 
Well, let's... We have doors. Don't want to flood... Flood, flood their area over there if possible. And he's making thrones in the floodgate. So we'll set him to make a few more doors. Uh, let's see. One of the farmers, I guess, can become a mechanic. Construct building. Building are you constructing? Oh, the door. Ah, that's right. Okay, that works. So, we'll go ahead and give you... Uh, mechanics. LeChuck. Our kitchen mechanic guy. Yeah. Making gadgets. And while we're at it, I want to get some bins going. All those crafts that are being made. So that's that. And while we're at it, I'm going to build. table over here once that's build built we'll set Ecleon to what are those fish of some sort seen it it'll look like a jellyfish seen an old jellyfish yellow sand downward slope those things would be Strange, they don't show up. Just holes, I guess. Okay. Well, there should be fish here now, guys. Get some jellyfish. I'm not a big fan of jellyfish, but certain Asian countries sure do. Okay. Back to work. So yeah, I've just played the most recent. I mean, this is 2010. It's the third bug fix. And there's still lots of bugs that need to be fixed later on. So I'm constantly making sure I keep my eyes open for any new releases. Um, I think Toady said in the last blog post I was reading that he's working on the OpenGL integration, which would be great. Um, supposedly it makes it run better. I don't know whether that's for sure. Um, on my new computer it might run better. I know on my old computer the OpenGL test stuff really did not run very well. So, there's that floodgate. So we have doors. Nope, still no doors. One, two, three, eight, four doors done. Come on, actually, I'm get to work. Oh, that must have been a bin, not a floodgate. I see. What are you doing, Eklan? He's drinking. Lovely. Yeah, how's the digging going? Oh, some of this will be stone, too. That's nice. Use it for walls and the like. And I know this is quite massive for a barracks area, but I think it'll work nicely, give me plenty of space, I can put beds along one wall or something, let them spar in the other, other side of the area. Hmm. It's been wet and rainy outside today, all congested while I'm doing these recordings. Not that you lot care, but... I'm just rambling on. And we're digging. And we're digging. We're digging some more. Dig, dig, dig. Grab some stone. And at least it gives the people who don't have jobs right now, like that other herbalist, to grab the stone and move it out of the way. Like 
got some groundhogs running around outside. Don't think that's a big issue. Ooh, one of our kittens has become a cat already. Yeah, as long as they're in the pit, I guess it doesn't matter that much to me. And we're out of time for this episode, so I shall see you next time.